In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to add a HTML signature to Gmail. Uh, for the purposes of today we're using uh, Chrome, uh, Google's browser, uh, and I'm going to be using an extension called AutoPen. Um, there are loads of different uh, HTML signature extensions out there depending on what browser you're using. The uh, simplest thing to do is just to, to Google um, the name of your browser and then Gmail signature. Um, uh, there is blank canvas on uh, Firefox um, and uh, a couple of different ones um, on, on Chrome. If you're unsure how to add them um, on Chrome, what we need to do is uh, go over to settings into extensions. You'll see at the bottom here a little link that says get more extensions. And then, like I said, the one that we're using today is Auto Pen. You can see I've already added it to Chrome because we, we already use it. Um, but all you'd need to do to install it is just to click, click this button here. Um, and it will then ask you to um, confirm that you want to add it to, to Chrome as an extension and it will appear in your preferences window here at the top. So to add a signature to it, um, what we need to do is go to Options and you'll see that's opened another tab, our Signature Editor. Um, up here at the top, you see I've already added one in, that's ours. But I'm going to create a new one, so uh, I can give it a name. In yours, it, it might be, you know, pop dance, so on and so forth, or it could be, you know, your name. Um, but for today, because I'm adding a three-month factory signature, and I'm adding the the generic one for our account, I'm going to add. Hello. Okay, now you can just type a signature into this box <coughs> and it will automatically add that. But obviously, we've created a nice uh, dynamic you know, um, HTML signature for you. Um, to put that in, what you need to do is click this little HTML button here. Okay, and then we just need to find the signature file. open it using a browser and then if you right click uh, we want to view page source select all that code copy it and then we back to our HTML box and just paste it in and you'll see this little button down here at the bottom that says update. Save that. And now you'll see Gmail has just refreshed. So when we go to compose a message, you'll see it's inserted our signature. Um, this is the little option bar. So I've got two different signatures in here now. We can select none if you want to remove it. I've got the signature that I've just added. I've also got my own in there, so you can add a, a couple that way. So that is the, the simplest way to add a, a HTML signature to uh, your Gmail account.